Obviously retiring from international cricket this year gave me a chance to go back and play some more domestic cricket and I really enjoyed it. My state team actually won the Sheffield Shield this year which was the first time in my 21 year career yeah. that I'd actually been a, a part of a Sheffield Shield winning team so, so that was a lot of fun and obviously coming back and wearing the Nike shoes through the, that, that season um, was fantastic. first part is correct that I have made a few runs, the second part about <laughs> eyeing off bowler shoes is not correct at all. Um, I've actually said to the boys at training this morning that... Uh, I actually bowled a few overs in the Big Bash back in Australia this yep. year. Bowled a few overs saw those, yep. Not quite as good as the way this guy bowls his off spin, but I won't be bowling in the IPL. The grounds are not big enough here, and we haven't got enough spare balls if, for me to come on and bowl. So <laughs> I've told the, the Mumbai guys today that I won't be bowling. You know, if, like today we train on some wet green wickets over at, uh, at uh, uh, Karnataka there, and uh, Sachin got the new ball out and was swinging it around everywhere, so he can still bowl, but not me. It's, I'm, a, I'm a little bit too old for that. But what if you're happy with, in your equipment, you're always going to play well. Uh, there's nothing worse than having you know, gloves that don't fit, a helmet that doesn't fit, or your shoes that, one, don't fit or are not comfortable enough or lightweight enough, like Ravi was saying. I mean, the amount of time that he spends, as he said, pivoting on his toes and the amount of force... You already mentioned, uh, it's about uh, how light the shoe needs to be. And, of course, my feedback towards them was that <coughs> I needed more cushioning on the heel uh, because I pivot a lot on my toe and the stress goes onto the toe a lot of the times and when I get back into the heel, I need more cushioning onto that. So that was very well heard of and this is probably one of the lightest shoes I've been in. It's, it's very important to listen to the athletes in the sense like what exactly Nike has done now because uh, what we give as a feedback generally boils down to what's remaining in the racks in the storeroom as you mm -hmm. said. So what, what feedback we do give actually helps the people in general. 